I like this, but sorry, this is my queen. Anyway, <laughs> you cannot just guys, throw listen, my hey, they are resistant. All right, listen, guys, this racket is the one I created. I'm so proud to present it. It's called Ruby because it was red since the beginning. Yeah. But again, who doesn't like colors? So now we have it in many colors and stuff. But uh, I'm a big fan of the red color. Red is passion, fire, and I like that. Yes, I'm, the I'm, devil. The devil. It's also somebody a bit cheeky sometimes. So it totally describes me the color. So this racket has Kevlar tubular here, yeah, with the highest quality. Then it has a Eva mix foam, which is. A bit stiffer. It's a bit stiffer than the gold one. With a higher density. But it's not a baseball bat. It's a, still such a nice feeling. For me, I like the 3K carbon on this racket because it keeps it just the perfect point for me to... I need something that helps me with a little bit of power because I'm someone that... Even though I look chubby and round, I'm not so strong. I'm fast, I'm very patient, but I'm not someone that relies on power, yes? So I need a weapon that helps me with my technique, which is, I consider, very, very clean. Yes, and very small. Very sharp and very small, because I've been trained that way. I need something that when I do a good pose of my shots, it helps me for the ball to go boom, instead of relearning my technique with a swing like this to generate power. I, I, I think for me, that would take too many repetitions, too many maybe months or years. Instead, we have spent time developing a racket, a weapon that helps me from here to, gener to generate to enough, yes, have a good reaction. Yeah. So as we said in other videos, with this racket, the ball is pam pam which I love, yeah? What are the, because you know, not everything is positive always. What are the, the downsides, cons or the yeah. downsides on this racket? Well, not downsides, but if you are someone that doesn't have a compact technique, then of course, as soon as you hit here, yeah, the ball the will ball, still react yeah, fast. So go. you are gonna lose control. Yeah. So it depends, for example, for me, this racket not only helps people with good technique, but also Someone that doesn't have the technique so small, it's a good investment to it buy is. this racket it because is. it will teach you or it will show you that you need to be smaller and more compact, which is good for your development as a player because as you get better, like we say, you get more round, more, more little ball. As you are worse, eh? you don't know if you're playing paddle or you're swimming or you're partying. Yes. So as you get better, boom, suddenly you are like one of my favorite players, like Gordo Gutierrez. Just the guy is like a little turtle here, and he plays amazing. I mean, I love the guy. He yeah. played in the Seniors World Cup, and I wish he would still play for 20 more years. But anyway, I'm going to show you how it hits. I'm going to show you the sound. I mean, I'm going to share the sound. I'm going to show you. I'm going to share the sound with you. And um, It's just a, a very nice racket. For example, one situation I like a lot is when I play my lob and I open my candy shop, Many times I like to block the, the Viboras or, or the, you know, the fast shots that come to my feet. And this racket in that way is so... You don't have to do anything. It's so given. Yeah. Yes, like as soon as my technique is there and my racket is in front, I can control the ball super well. And then it helps me to transition from a very tough situation to a neutral situation. And why not? Sometimes dominate the net after that. So for me, it's a perfect fit. I mean, I, I cook it myself. So... Of course, the racket is not going to... I mean, if you expect the racket to fix... The racket hasn't given me a smash. Or <laughs> shots to you without working and without doing the work of, you know, training, repetition, yeah. baskets, that's not, that's, that's not going to happen. But to me, this racket is super comfortable. I mean, it has enough power. It has a very good... Uh, more than power this way, now that you bring up the smash... For me, when I kick, because I play with kick, I don't have power. Again, I, I say it for the fifth time, I don't have power, but I have the skills in the way that I can kick the ball, for example. I used to play tennis. 
I had a very good kick. So that's why I was better in doubles and singles. So the, 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 the reaction I get from the, from the racket is amazing. I have to share my opinion when I'm, when you are defending my volleys and I'm at the net. Yes. With that racket, your ball feels so heavy. Like it's very hard to volley because constantly I feel the ball is, is pushing yeah. me, like I mean, compared it, to other rackets. Yeah, it makes sense what you, what you say because if, if also probably since the ball leaves so, so soon. Yeah. My racket, even though we're talking about milliseconds, half of a second yes. or milliseconds, you are receiving it sooner. Yeah. So of course it's going yeah. to be different from someone that has a racket that maybe the ball stays a little bit longer on their hand. For me, I like that the ball goes. Yeah. yeah. So let's see how it, how it hits. Boom. So I don't need a big swing. Just there. Very easy. Boom. With the glass, I just need to open. I drive. Yeah. I need to open. I drive. If I body, boom, it reacts so nicely. Bam. Yes, full control. If I need to play a low, it's, uh, it's just. What a beauty. Anyway, guys, again, the best way is that you make an investment. I mean, I know we have a lot of people that love our rackets, but they are like, you know, I never bought a racket without testing it. And we wish we could send rackets to all of you, but it's not realistic. Also, remember, this is a sidekick for us. Yeah, we are extremely busy with other things, but we love the brand. We love the rackets. And we are willing to talk in public like this, in this, in this case, using a YouTube platform. Yeah. Because we have produced something that we are okay making it public. We are okay. But it's taking, not a secret. Taking like, the responsibility yes. of telling you, listen, be brave. Buy a racket without testing it. You will love it. And I'm trying, Enrica, helping you here by giving you some review of a racket, but you know, you only live once. Don't, don't tell me, ah, I never bought something without testing. Come on, man. What about restaurants? You go and say, hey, let me try your sauce. No, I'm not eating here. No. <laughs> hey, let, me, let me try a, a one quarter of tortilla. Oh, no, no, it's too oily. You don't, you don't do that. You see it. The waitress is nice. You start getting a good feeling. You want a beer? Yeah, you want some nachos? Yes. Hey, what do you recommend? What is the best thing in this restaurant? You don't say, hey. Let me test the fucking tacos, and if I like them, I pay, but if I don't like them, I go. No, guys, so don't be so complex. I mean, I just gave you a nice philosophy here. You like the racket? Buy it. You don't need to test it. I promise. It's on my shoulders. You will love it, and then you will want, not one, you will want five of them. In five different, in different colors. colors, yes. And maybe one day you say, oh, well, can I cook mine? I like the 12K instead of the 3K. Yeah. This is also a nice feeling. Yeah, but don't tell me, I, I like it, but I need to test it. That's why I'm here. That's why Rika is here. We give you a certification of this product. Now it's up to you if you believe it or not. Bye.